Greetings humanoids of planet Earth. My name is Bob and uh, we are playing Planet Explorers and apparently we're going to have a night attack by a bunch of beasties. Uh, I'm doing, I was, wasn't, wasn't what I planned to do uh, uh, at the moment but um, this is what we have. Um, and uh, so a bunch of beasties are going to attack and we need to kill them. And I, I'm going to hazard a guess these are not. Um, particularly tough beasties. Um, this is actually a, a mission that should have been done fairly early on, uh, which I didn't do. So I imagine it's just going to be like those uh, those uh, kitty cats and stuff. Okay. Time to get some. Come on, kitty cats, get some. You guys are just standing here like... Whoa! Oh, that was that. Get a cat! Oh, birdies! Those guys are, those guys are pretty hard, hard ass. <laughs> Sucks to be you! You guys are just standing out here like you... Everything in the neighborhood is attacking us. Monkeys and everything else. We gotta get these guys away. Uh, cannons need to be taken care of it. Okay. Is that it? Oh shit. I think I decided I don't really like this planet. Oh man, well, welcome. What's wrong with you? Every American child lo loves this planet. I guess I should get the meat off this guy first, huh? Since he's the biggest. Yeah, buddy. This is the new frontier, man. What you talking about? Yeah, that was a slaughter. I'm gonna need to take these cannons back and um, not have them here permanently. Uh, because it's overkill. Uh, and plus, I might want to have those for something else. Okay, we lose anybody? That's uh, Chan Zen. Where's the doctor? Oh, Gertie! You're back amongst living. What are you up to this time? You think I could have? Here, Take two rations. Oh, like now? How you feeling? Like I've been hit by a speeding truck. Can I take a turn in that thing, man? I, I, I need a little downtime. Where's the worst good doctor? He was here talking. Oh well, maybe I'll wait until daytime to find him. Okay, well, our, our project for uh, that was going to be their project for today is um, uh, what the hell? Why is that lit up now? But I'm not gonna go find out until morning, I guess. Well, I could go now. Um, it's uh, there's a, a some something a, a, a fast travel landmark over here somewhere that I haven't found yet. So that's where I was gonna head to go. Head to go. That's where I was gonna head to go. Uh, and um, uh, so that's what we will do um, uh, once I restart this video. Uh, and uh, then we're I'm gonna lay down here and go to sleep for a bit, and then not not in real life in the game. Uh, and then, then uh, we'll catch up uh, when I'm when I'm done with that. Okay, we're gonna wander over um, uh, to my house. Uh, actually, first I'm gonna eat a smoked sausage. There we go. Mmm, 
the smoked sausage. One thing to know uh, is apparently uh, that that when you pause or like you're in the uh, in the exit menu or the the, the save menu, or whatever, uh, the game doesn't stop. Apparently, um, it's kind of annoying. Um, so I suppose that while you're save, saving or you're, you've escaped and you've gone off to do something like I just had a cigarette, um, that you can still get eaten. So, uh, but you know, as long as you got a save game, it's all good. Or one of those revive shots. Uh, I got uh, plenty of wood. I don't need to worry about wood right now. Also, sometimes your your weapons, uh, not your weapons, your like your stationary weapons, like uh, catapults and shit. Hey, bitch, come get some. <laughs> bitch, please. I'm also short on meat. I'm short on meat and I'm short on iron. <laughs> yeah, come on. <laughs> and so, all the meat I can get is good. Uh, so, uh, if you, like, place defenses, and not necessarily there when you come back. Or they might be there, but they're kind of glitched. Uh, so if you try to put another, say, arrow catapult where you put one before, uh, then the old one will appear on top of the new one, non-functional, of course. Yeah, see, there should be arrow catapults all over here, here and some cannon. Uh, so it's just a good idea probably to take your defenses with you. Oh, where's my... where's the entrance? Over here. Don't know my own house. It's been a while since I've been back. Also, the doors uh, don't use them. They're um, once you place them, you can never get them back, and you can't turn them or anything, so it's not so good. Yeah, here's my humble abode. I just left this wall out so I could have a nice uh, view of what's going on. A uh, bed, a couple of bookcases, a uh, nice table with chairs, a uh, nice porch out here. And get up on the roof. There we go. Uh, also, uh, I'll show you uh, the gun I made. And thanks to uh, Ravenclaw Tom. I don't want to use your real name because I don't know if you if you want me to do that. Uh, but uh, YouTube uh, uh, tag Ravenclaw Tom, and I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, thanks uh, to you for um, uh, leading me in the direction of the uh, um, multi-shot uh, muzzle thing, which I I was making me pull my hair out trying to figure out where it was. Uh, let me show you what it is, what I've made. Uh, it's not pretty. Uh, I've never intended it to be pretty. There's no dye on it or anything. Oh, and it's gone away. Where's the ISO? ISO. Well, I have, I had ISOs in here and they've gone away. Let's try that again. Okay. Oh, well, for whatever reason, it's forgotten my eyes. Um. Good. But anyway, you can see it. Whoa! You can see it here. It's nothing to look at, but it's uh, made with the best materials. Uh, that I had, which is at the time, which is steel, um, and it uh, it does um, uh, it's attack 90, um, 95, speed 2.5. Uh, I have no idea what those other things are. Uh, anyway, uh, and it's worth 109 meat, um, and that's as it means it would retail for like two 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 oh nine meat something like that. Anyway, it's uh, very effective. Uh, it can kill the big big dogs. Uh, that's what you need. Um, now it's giving me a quest arrow over here for some reason. I have no idea why. Uh, but since it's on the way to where we're heading, which is over here, we'll just go ahead and warp on over there. I think I've showed you most of what I have here. A couple little windows. And nothing nothing fancy. Uh, but a uh, girl needs her comforts, you know. Uh, got a hole in the roof let smoke out. And even though you have a roof, you're, uh, if, when it rains, it's, it's still going to come right through the roof anyway. So, um... Kitty, 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 kitty. Nice kitty. Uh, and doesn't look like you, you take any fall damage, as far as I know. Um, I'm not gonna test it too much. 
Oh yeah, you do take some small fall damage. And I need your meat. Come here. Don't disappear before I take your meat. I need your meat, please. Meat. Meat. Surely you have meat. Uh, after about a minute, they go away, so. Get off. And those animals, for some reason, drop fruit as well. I have no idea why. Kitty, 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 kitty. Uh, and escape below. This gun escape below one shotting these guys. Which is good, because they're a nuisance. I mean, they're... actually, they can still kill you. Uh, I've got uh, leather armor here, but, um, but those kitty cats uh, can still kill you if you don't uh, deal with them. So, all right, let's go ahead and warp on over to uh, uh, meteorite. See what kind of mission thing is happening there. I have no idea what that would be. Oh, and it crashed. Okay, well, apparently there's a couple of new missions. Uh, the idea is, is that uh, we're supposed to regroup all the survivors in, into one base camp. Uh, and la di da da da. <laughs> and I'm going to do all that, but um, I need to um, uh, I need to uh, go check out this this area first. Um, well, I don't know why I've got a, a giant tree marker now. Whatever. Um, actually, I could probably kill two birds with one stone. Uh, instead of warping over here to the meteorite crater and going up there, I could just warp over here to rock formation. Uh, talk to those guys, get them back to the base camp. Uh, I'm not sure where we would put... He, he wants us to uh, build a um, uh, uh, a camp for all of us to live in at some point. I'm not sure where Look, I'd put... Look! Another survivor! Yes, I, I already talked to you once. Besides me and Adisa here, there was another Martian lady with us. I think her name was Daida? But she went back to the boat to see if anyone else survived, and we've been waiting for her here since. I'm really worried. You know what? Do you think you can go with me to the nest and take a look? The nest? Look, I know it's going to be dangerous, but how about I give you the scripts to the uh. steel axe, pickaxe, and shovel? Oh, steel. Okay. I got iron now. Yeah, who? Hell yeah, let's do it. All right. Where is the nest? Oh, it's over there. Okay. The nest, whatever the hell that means. I don't know what to expect from these Martians. Dude, you are so slow. Move your ass. Oh, well, this may be kind of uneventful for a while. This was not what I really planned to do straight away anyway. So well, I'll let you know when something happens. Okay, okay, we're arriving near the crash site. And there's a few of these, uh, these nasty guys. Uh, they're not hard to kill, but they, they will kill you with one shot. Uh... They get a chance. You know, they're, like many creatures around here, they can one hit you. Uh, better just kill them. Uh, and these, these clown dogs here. Hey, clown dog. Take care of my little bit of my meat problem. Okay, fire bears. I don't want to get my guy killed, or else I probably attack. Rhinos generally are non-aggressive, uh, so I generally leave them alone unless they 
screw with me. Uh, unlike what happens in real life, uh, I generally speaking uh, kill the predators and leave the prey alone. Uh, he's leaving me alone. Oh, oh shit! Fuck me. Okay, I, I don't know. These guys, I think, are not not typically hostile. They are big though. Yeah, unlike unlike in real life, uh, I generally kill predators and leave prey alone because prey leave me alone. It's kind of simple. Of course, uh, in real life, uh, predators don't taste too good, and they're not too healthy for you. You know, so. Okay, still looking for the Martian lady. You got a nice little natural land bridge here, so we can cross over. Uh, this water is uh, clear, unlike um, the seawater. Uh, maybe I'll see some fishes or something in there. Gators or something. Nope. Looks pretty much devoid of life. Are you still with me, buddy? Okay, excellent. Here's that, that forest, a very cool forest. Uh, Hey, bitch! Now, the, those clown dogs are not uh, too dangerous, and they get, get a fair amount of meat off them, so... They're annoying, though. Get stepped on there, bud. Come a long way. Okay, I'm, I'm curious to see what a Martian looks like. Look, Dade is there, and another person too. They don't look so good. Oh, come on, they, they saw us. I'll go help them. Keep the bears busy. Can do. Go. Guys will one hit you. Uh, back in the action. Oh fuck! Run away! Run away! Oh, okay, I was had my had my copper arrow ah, bullets up. Meat. It's what's for dinner. <laughs> On this planet, meat's what's for dinner. Nests. What kind of fucking nests? Are, are these Martian nests? Them. Oh shit! All right, we got we got issues. Apparently, I didn't take care of all the fire bears. Hey, over here, asshole!
Fire bear! It's what's for dinner. It's more like fire cow. Okay, what else we got? Oh, Dan Denny. Oh, well, she looks like a human being. Coming to trade? Uh, my few more revival shots. They're pretty expensive. All right, homeboy. What's? Mm-hmm. Look, Dade is there, and another person too. They don't look so. Yes, we already did this. Come uh, on, They saw us. I'll go help them. Keep the bears busy. I just did that. Yeah, yeah, okay. Nests. What kind of nests? Uh, they're obviously human beings, so they obviously don't need the nests. I would assume, because they they don't look in any any in any way even slightly non-human. Yeah, I'm assuming that they've gone off to uh, go back to the others. Nice ship, looks fairly intact. Too bad it doesn't fly. I, I still don't have any idea what the hell Martians really are, or why they need nests. But okay. Uh, and uh, they're wanting me to go over here. Actually, I need to um, let's pop back to the rock formation right quick. And then we need to go north to try to find that uh, other other thing. Well, the reason why I'm looking for it is supposedly it has. Uh, oh well, fuck it, crashed. Okay, well, fortunately it appears to auto save at important moments. Or no, maybe it doesn't. I oh, know the uh, big guy isn't here, but she's still here. Got stuff for me? There was a Martian doctor with us. She went back to the crash site even when we told her it was certain death. Lao wants to go to the crash site to see if anyone else survived. I can't really help in my current state, but. I really state. want to get back there as well and see if I can salvage anything. If you can go clear out those pesky bears, that would be a great help. In return, I'll give you the scripts for wood bow and arrows. Okay, well we already done that. Uh, it's, it's glitching. Great deal. I'll wait here until you get back. Good luck. Might really need it. No shit. See you later. They already killed me once. Ah, kill fire bears. Hey, what are you guys doing? Always bring a light. Okay. They're just hanging out here. All right. Kill fire bears. Oh, it's a fire bear nest. Okay. Get some. Oh, and I've got no. It's somehow rather cleared my shit out. I got bullets. No, I don't. Well, fudge. Let me see what I have here. Iron one. I guess we're gonna have to use copper bullets. It sucks. I need more iron. 
Now, this is the fire bear nest, I assume. That makes some kind of sense. Hey, bud. How you feeling? Oh. <laughs> yeah, equip bullets. Thank you. Yeah. Get some. Now I need meat anyway. Come on. I say I needed meat anyway. Get all. Hey, fire bears. Where you bitches at? Okay, well, uh, sometimes the quests are a little glitchy. Um, like, for instance, I already killed all these fucking fire bears, and now I gotta kill them again. Uh, it's assuming that they're, they're around. I have to just go out and see if I can find some random fire bears. What the hell is this hallucinogenic thing? Okay, now let's just go just go find some random fire bears to kill. Hey, you would think that they would respawn here after a while, but whatever. And if I don't get some uh, metal soon, I'm going to be having an issue. Really have any great desire to use copper bullets. Alright, well, when I find somebody, I'll let you know. Okay, I had to stop by the mines because uh, copper, copper bullets is not the way we roll. We don't roll like that. Uh, so, as you can see, I've been uh, digging quite a bit, and this is not the entire extent of the, my digging. So, um, I need to find that other spot so I can find another source of iron just in case this. Iron winds up being a limited commodity. You I mean, probably know they have all the iron in the world underneath here, but you know, it's always good to have a second source of vital vital materials. Oh, uh, and you have to um, mine, if you're mining for metals, you have to mine with a shovel, not a pickaxe. Uh, and it's a good idea to try to find the um, uh, iron shovel as soon as you can, uh, because you get a lot more metal out of it. And I only recently just figured out that you can drop these torches, you don't have to carry them around. Uh, so if you need to light up a spot like a dark, dank mine, you can always just drop a few torches and you're good to go. <laughs> I've got to figure out how we can get out of here. Okay. 
Okay, where's the exit for this place? Okay, uh, I don't know uh, how well you can see this, but um, uh, over here you can see some iron. That's what iron looks like, uh, sort of dark, um, stony, stony material. Uh, don't bother looking at Bridgeport too much outside of um, these uh, craters and stuff because uh, it's not probably not around. Or at least I haven't been around. Uh, this um, this reddish substance over here uh, is uh, copper, uh, which is totally not the way it is in nature. In nature, uh, copper uh, deposits tend to look green because that's the way copper oxidizes. Uh, and the iron deposits tend to look red because that's the way iron oxidizes. Uh, so, uh, but if you're looking looking for uh, trying to get some particular metal, um, that's what the deposits look like. 